She captured the secret of life, but the world almost forgot her name. This is Rosalind Franklin, the woman behind the double helix. Born in 1920 in London, she was smart, stubborn, and always asking why. At just 15, she decided to become a scientist. In a time when women weren't welcome in labs, she studied at Cambridge, specializing in physics and chemistry, breaking barriers every step. But her real breakthrough came with X-ray crystallography, a method to see molecules. In 1951, she joined King's College London to study DNA, the molecule of life. There she took photo 51, the first clear image of DNA's double helix. But without her knowing, her colleague Morris Wilkins showed the photo to rival scientists. Watson and Crick used that image to complete their model and took all the credit. Franklin never knew how key her work had been to their discovery. She moved on to study viruses, producing brilliant research until illness struck. In 1958, at just 37, Rosalind died from ovarian cancer, likely caused by radiation exposure. Four years later, Watson, Crick, and Wilkins won the Nobel Prize. Rosalind, not even mentioned. She couldn't be awarded posthumously, and her role was buried in history books. But decades later, scientists and historians fought to give her the credit she deserved. Today, she's remembered as the unsung heroine of DNA, the woman who saw what others couldn't. Rosalind Franklin, not just a scientist, a pioneer, a legacy, a name we must never forget.